In this video, we will learn how to configure nlog with the ASP.NET Core application. nlog is an open source logging framework that helps to easily configure logging for your .NET applications. Step 1, open Visual Studio 2019 and select Create a new project. Next dialog, select ASP.NET Core Web App Model View Controller Template, and click Next. Next dialog, provide project name, location, and solution name and click Create. Step 2, Install nlog package. In order, to install nlog package, right click on the project, and select manage new get package. Step 3, Nlog Configuration, Config File, the Nlog Configuration file, is a simple XML file, that is used to hold the config settings related to Nlog. This file, will be created in the root folder of the project, while installing the Nlog dependencies. If not, then create an Nlog.config file under the root folder of the project. The file contains two main elements, that are target and rules. The target element, is used to define the target log file path, and name, and other target details. The rules element, is used to configure the rules of loggers, we can configure minimum and maximum level, of logs for each logger. The nlog.config file, needs to be copied, to the build directory every time, you build the application. So, we need to change the property settings, for this file, right click on nlog.config, and click properties, and change the value for copy to output directory, to, copy always, or copy if newer. Step 4, nlog configuration for ASP.NET Core. Open program.cs file. Then configure the nlog logger class, and capture the error while creating the host builder.
Step 5, How to Test and Log Logging, in ASP.NET Core Application. In order, to test the and log logging, we can inject the logger class, into the home controller constructor, and log the information and error messages. Note, the logger class is available in every controller. Now, run the application, and see the logs folder. If you open the log file, you will find the logging details.